Hey guys, welcome back to the Duant Moore Show, where we are out and about and still recording. This story comes from Game Rant <clears throat> by Kyle Sledge, and it is in reference to Diablo. Diablo 3 offers double XP this weekend. According to a recent announcement from Diablo 3 community manager Ty- Tyler, the most recent installment of Blizzard's action role-playing game franchise is set to offer double XP this weekend as a mean to apologize to fans who waited patiently during the delay encounter in the implement of patch 2.6.0's hot fixes last Friday. Furthermore, the publisher and developer is also making the event available in order to make amends with those affected by the legendary gem exploit as there were some players who took advantage of the bug to increase their gem count to over 140. Since certain Diablo 3 fans were who decided not to use the exploit feel like they are now at a permanent disadvantage, the game's upcoming double XP weekend, which starts this Friday, July 14th at 5 p.m. Pacific Time and ends on Monday, July 17th at 10 a.m. Pacific Time, should allow them to level up, level the playing field. Of course, this will be a rare opportunity for players to gain experience points faster than usual. As Tyler explains, quote, although we generally don't provide such buffs in order to discourage people from only playing when a buff is active, we feel like the unusual circumstances in this case <laughs> warrant an exception. While, unquote, while some Diablo 3 players might assert that those who took advantage of the legendary gem exploit deserve punishment in some shape or form, it looks as if Blizzard is taking a different approach to fixing the problem streaming from the buggy interaction between the fertility, fra, fra, frailty ability of the necromancer and the green reaper ruin from the demon hunter ability marked for death. Also, it also happens non-seasonal characters are having a gem rollback to normally achievable levels at the moment. But, consider, but considering the publisher and developers track record with moderating its games communities, Blizzard could eventually dish out some type of penalty to those who use the exploit. However, Tavlar offered no word on that occurring at this point. Quote, we, are, we will be rolling back legendary gem levels to the maximum gem level that would have been legitimately achievable prior to the patch going live. As with all previous exploits, any additional actions we may take will not be discussed outside of our staff and official individuals. Unquote. All things considered, the double XP weekend may not be exactly what the fans affected by the legendary gem exploit want, as most of the non-cheating users have expressed that the right thing to do is ban those who took advantage of the situation. Nevertheless, it is the only situation Blizzard is bringing to the table at, as of now. But like it has previously done with Overwatch, a mass cheating ban could go in effect in the near future. Diablo 3 is available now for PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. I for a heartily agree with those players. I feel like if you took a game, took advantage and gained the system when you shouldn't have to achieve things that you shouldn't have, you're cheating the system and y'all know how I feel about cheaters. Cheaters. Stop it. Stop cheating. You're ruining the game. So I always say ban them, ban them forever, perma ban. Anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Thank you for all your views. Thank you for your subscriptions. I love all you guys. You guys rock. You make my show, my, you make my show, our show. And thank you for being here because you could have spent your time anywhere, but you chose to spend it here with me. And for that, I'm truly thankful. Thank you.